Hey, it's Candace, one mom with a plan, and we invite you along for our travel adventures from the planning to the destination. Today, we are headed down Jake's Creek Trail. Hopefully, we will be able to find the Advent Cabin. So here we go, come with us. It's gonna be a great day of hiking. Wondering if thousands of miles away, the sky is just as blue. It's as if I'm stuck in yesterday When I'm thinking of you Cause when you have your morning coffee I'm turning out the lights so I could dream And when you smile through the screen I wish you could be with me So I lay my head to rest When the sun is rising I'll start a brand new day along Jake's Creek Trail. We've barely taken a few steps up and we've already hit our first homestead. So Jake's Creek Trail runs along what is called Society Hill or was Society Hill. So these are the remnants and the remains of about 26 homes that used to be here. In total in the Elkmont area there were over 70 homes. 26 of them were here a part of Society Hill. And I think that there is still a cabin that remains on the trail today. So come with us. Let's go find it. So this trail follows the old railroad that was built in 1909 by the Little River Company. We should have about 482 in elevation gain today. And it's rated as easy. So we've got a little bit of an incline taking place, but it's not bad. And we're actually on a partially paved trail, which you don't find very often. Let's go see what else we can find. So here we are. This is the house that was once leased by Colonel David Chapman. Um, this individual was definitely one of the individuals influential in helping to create the Great Smoky Mountains. And of the 26 homes that were a part of Society Hill, this one right here, is the one that remains. So, looks a little bit sketchy, I'll be honest. Maybe not something that I feel completely comfortable walking through with the broken glass, the doors barely on the hinges, but definitely wanted to give you a view of this last remaining cabin. So once you reach the Jake's Creek Trail sign, you wanna continue on for four tenths of a mile on up. Here we go, let's see if we can find the cabin. So the cabin, the Avent cabin that we're going to today was purchased by Frank Avent in 1918. And it was then purchased by the Park Service in 1932. Now, the family did continue to use the home until their lifetime lease expired, and that was in 1992. Again, we're on a trail. This is an off trail today, so off the trail trail, and we're going to see if we can't find those hidden wooden steps off to the right-hand side to be able to find the cabin. So we've just passed Cucumber Gap Trail, and this should be Miggs Trail coming up, which is not the direction that we're wanting to go today. So let's check it out and make sure that we're going to head down the right path here. Let's see what we can find. To the Sinks, Curry Mountain Trail, Miggs Mountain Trail, or straight ahead, Jake's Creek Trail. So Jake's Creek Trail to the left, stay, stay to the left. Here we go. Always fun when you can see wildlife on the trail. Hi girls. Hold on one second. Let's see if we can get this turkey. Dad's got a steel shot of it. Let's see what we can do. All right, be still. A little bit 
bit closer. It's off to the side. You can see it now. It's kind of looking at, oh, it's shake your tail feather, shake your tail feather. I'm zoomed in. Okay, here we are. We're walking up and we have found the wooden steps right here off the path. So I would say, guys, it's not real defined where to go off. You absolutely need to be looking, but when you spy those wooden steps, you know that you're in this right spot. So here we are, we're still making our way. Of course, I didn't bring water shoes today, but they've got an awesome little bridge up here ahead for us to be able to cross. So, here we go across the stream, Jake's Creek, here we come. The Avent cabin was built around 1850 by Humphrey Owen, making this cabin the second oldest cabin in Elkmont. Early in the morning, before the sun appears, before the world has even stirred. Let's get out of here We don't need to hurry The road ahead is clear Let's follow the coast as far as it goes Or until we disappear That gives me an idea but somebody didn't quite have the rocks moved out of the way all the way. Mom, what's that thing? That's the journal that you can sign saying that you have found the cabin. There's pens inside the box and there's actually pictures of her artwork for you to be able to see. Let's move this out of the way. Look, these are copies of the artwork that Miss Avent was able, just some historical, documents. Mom, can we write our name? So, so very, very cool. Mom, can we write our name? So this hike in total um, requires about a 1.2 mile hike on Jake's Creek Trail from the parking lot near Daisy Town in the Appalachian Clubhouse up here to the Avent Cabin. It was a fun hike. Definitely you felt like you were on an adventure when you came to this one. Uh, we would love for you to join you join us on all of our adventures. Um, so please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel. We love going on hikes here in the Smoky Mountains, which is so close to home.